Greetings. I have been trying to understand the human obsession with food, so I have come to Nashville to explore. One place I had to see while I was in town was Manel's at the Manor. It's an old, large human house right next to the airport. Instead of humans using this house to live in and protect themselves from the weather, they sit at tables and eat huge amounts of fried chicken carcasses and other food that is designed to reduce their lifespans. Last night, my servant Peter and I went to Prince's Hot Chicken Shack in Nashville. This is another establishment that serves fried chicken carcasses for human consumption, although these carcasses are seasoned with some sort of proprietary blend of ingredients that cause humans to cry and overheat while they eat it. I came here to better understand humans and their relationship with food, but I am failing completely. If any of you viewers have any insight, please send me an electronic mail or leave a comment below. I am at a loss. After the food excursion, I'm returning to the Gaylord Opryland Hotel. I will wander around this place, as it is infinitely bizarre to me. I have asked several people why a hotel this large was built, but I cannot get a direct answer. It started out as a normal hotel, but they just kept adding more and more. Maybe the hotel is owned by a human with some sort of mental disease. That seems like the most reasonable explanation to me. All in all, I have to say Nashville is a charming city. The humans all seem to love the food. So if you are a human that enjoys food, you might as well come here and partake. The music is quite lively, and the players seem to be experts. I don't enjoy music, but again, if you are a human that enjoys music, this is the place for you. Of course, if you are a human that enjoys music and food, then you really must visit humans.